Hello friends and welcome back. In the aftermath of the withdrawal of Western forces from Afghanistan, attention has turned to China's increasing economic investments in the country. This shift in focus underscores the evolving dynamics of global economic engagement and the recalibration of geopolitical interests in the region. As the Taliban assumed power in Kabul in 2021, speculation arose regarding China's potential to capitalize on the economic landscape of Afghanistan, characterized by abundant mineral resources and untapped hydrocarbon reserves, notably lithium. Throughout the first half of 2023, pivotal discussions transpired between Chinese officials and representatives of the Taliban, signaling the prospect of significant economic agreements. These deliberations laid the groundwork for the exploration of lucrative ventures, particularly in the realm of mining projects, underscoring the potential symbiosis between China's economic ambitions and Afghanistan's resource-rich terrain. Against the backdrop of Afghanistan's precarious economic conditions, characterized by instability and fragility, substantial investments in key sectors offer a dual promise, fostering socio-economic development for Afghan communities and bolstering the foundations of the Taliban regime. Notably, in a landmark agreement in 2023, the Taliban's Minister of Mines and Oil, in conjunction with the Central Asia Oil and Gas Company of Xinjiang, inked a contract aimed at the development of oil and gas fields in northern Afghanistan. The agreement, granting a 25-year drilling privilege, heralds a commitment to inject approximately $540 million over the initial three years while generating employment opportunities for 3,000 locals. Moreover, China's strategic overtures extend beyond conventional energy sectors, encompassing the burgeoning lithium market. A proposal by Guin, a Chinese firm, to invest $10 billion in lithium exploration and extraction underscores China's expansive economic vision for Afghanistan. This comprehensive proposal encompasses refining operations within the country and the initiation of pivotal infrastructure projects, including hydroelectric dams and road networks, emblematic of China's multifaceted economic engagement strategy. Furthermore, the resumption of commercial flights and the reopening of land routes between China and Afghanistan underscore the tangible momentum in bilateral trade relations. These developments, coupled with discussions surrounding Afghanistan's vast resources including lead, zinc and talc, underscore the depth of economic collaboration envisaged between the two nations. Against the backdrop of evolving economic dynamics, Afghanistan's strategic significance as a potential corridor for China's Belt and Road Initiative has garnered considerable attention. Despite being designated as a secondary route within the broader framework of the China-Pakistan Economic Corridor, Afghanistan's strategic positioning remains contingent upon its connectivity with regional partners. The proposition of a direct road linking China and Afghanistan, albeit challenging in its execution, embodies the aspirations of both nations to transcend logistical impediments and forge deeper economic integration. However, amidst the promise of economic prosperity, Afghanistan confronts inherent challenges, including infrastructural deficits and geopolitical complexities. The realization of Afghanistan's economic potential hinges upon the establishment of peace and stability, prerequisites essential for sustainable development and foreign investment. Moreover, Afghanistan's lithium reserves, touted as pivotal to its economic resurgence, necessitate a nuanced assessment of extraction costs and logistical feasibility. Notwithstanding, China's pragmatic engagement strategy, underscored by a policy of non-intervention, presents a stark departure from Western approaches characterized by political and economic sanctions. 
China's reluctance to formally recognize the Taliban regime while advocating for unconditional aid and the liberation of Afghanistan's assets underscores its nuanced diplomatic maneuvering and tacit legitimization of the Taliban's authority. In navigating the complex geopolitical landscape, the Taliban administration endeavors to leverage China's pragmatic stance to consolidate its domestic legitimacy and stimulate economic revitalization. Notably, the Taliban's pursuit of responsible monetary and macroeconomic policies underscores its aspiration for economic self-sufficiency and reduced reliance on external aid. Amidst geopolitical realignments, China's strategic alignment with the Taliban regime, albeit nuanced, bears significant implications for regional dynamics and global power equilibrium. As Afghanistan navigates the contours of economic resurgence and geopolitical recalibration, the convergence of Chinese economic interests and Taliban aspirations heralds a new chapter in the region's geopolitical narrative. China's burgeoning economic investments in post-Western Afghanistan underscore the evolving contours of global economic diplomacy and geopolitical maneuvering. The nexus between economic revitalization, political stability, and regional integration presents both opportunities and challenges for Afghanistan as it navigates the complexities of a shifting geopolitical landscape. As China assumes a central role in shaping Afghanistan's economic trajectory, the implications of this strategic partnership resonate far beyond the region encapsulating broader dynamics of global power politics and economic interdependence. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.